Good morning, everybody. Michael the Maven. I have some great news. I think we have figured out the soft focus issue on the Canon 90D. I have to give credit to the 90D group I have over on Facebook. Check it out if you're a 90D owner. What happened was we had a lot of users saying, my focus is soft. They were sending it into Canon. They were returning the cameras and a number of people have talked about soft focus. This doesn't have anything to do with the tracking problem that I noted in another video. When Canon announced the 5DS and the 5DSR, those are full frame sensored cameras. They also published a list of lenses that they said use these lenses on these cameras. They have enough resolving power. If you don't know what resolving power is, or you are unfamiliar with MTF charts, I have a great video on it. It discusses, it breaks it down. You owe it to yourself if you're spending thousands of dollars on lenses and you don't know what it is. I'm not saying that in a mean way, just educate yourself a little bit and you're going to have a very powerful tool when selecting lenses and troubleshooting and things of that nature. When those cameras came out, basically Canon was saying that you need very sharp lenses in order to get details to be easily visible. Now, one measurement of this is referred to as pixel pitch. It's essentially the distance between two sensors, which are the things that create pixels. On a sensor, they're often referred to as pixels. Let's not get caught up in semantics. Suffice it to say, pixel pitch is the distance between the sensors. And that pixel pitch on those cameras was 4.1 microns. Now, when we look at the Canon 90D and we see 32.5 megapixels crammed into an APS-C size sensor, and we do the math, it comes out to about 3.2 microns. So the smaller the distance between those sensors, the tighter the space, the more resolving power you are going to need in order to get tack sharp focus. And that list of lenses that Canon published for those full frame sensors, some of those lenses may not have enough resolving power. It's one of these things where it really depends on the copy of your lens. If you're using zoom lenses, it may be different focal lengths and things of that nature. Suffice it to say one culprit that we did find was the 100 to 400. This is the version one. I believe it came out in 1998. So 21 years ago. They weren't thinking about resolving power on sensors at the time. And what we're seeing with this lens on the 90D is that when they're zoomed in and they're looking at the center, sometimes it's a little sharp, but when you're at that 400 end, it gets a little soft. And what's probably happening is the lens is, is losing enough resolving power for the pixel density of the sensor. So very important to know this before you come to the conclusion that the 90D it has a major problem. It doesn't because I've seen very sharp images posted and I have seen some very soft images posted. And the conclusion that I'm coming to is it's the resolving power. One of the things that I'm skeptical about is that if these sensors are out resolving lenses, are the kit lenses enough for them? So Canon really needs to publish a list of the APS-C lenses and whether or not there's enough resolving power. When we take a look at the M6 Mark II, remember that's an EF-M mount. That's a completely different uh, class of lenses. And so we need some information about those lenses and their resolving power. My recommendation would be if you're looking at the 90D, take a look at those lenses that Canon has already published for the 5DS and the 5DSR. It's a good place to start. The second thing I would strongly recommend is learn to read MTF charts. They're not always perfect. They're more like averages, but it will give you a good idea if a particular lens model would be enough. And then compare those different lens MTF charts with the MTF charts of the lenses that Canon has already recommended. And that should give you a ballpark idea if we're talking about maybe third party brands or lenses that you're not sure of. But in any event, the 90D soft focusing issue is almost undoubtedly related to the resolving power of the lenses. Let me know what questions you guys have. It can be about the 90D or in general about photography. I have a lot more great videos coming out. So hit that subscription bell if you like this kind of stuff. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.